Well, a local religious leader accused of abusing the trust of his congregation is back in the Bay Area now facing sexual assault charges. The number of the victims stands at five, but investigators are looking into whether there are others. Eight on your side, senior investigator Walt Buteau has that story. For the first time since he was charged at the beginning of this month, this once trusted member of an Islamic congregation is back in the Bay Area. He faces three criminal counts and a civil lawsuit that accuses him of drugging and molesting children he was asked to teach and guide. The five-year volunteer youth director at the Sly Mosque was arrested by federal agents in Chicago and transported to the Pinellas County Jail over the weekend. 51-year-old Ehab Gonim is charged with three counts of unlawful sexual activity with minors, and his bond is set at $450,000. According to Pinellas Park Police, Gonim met the five victims at the mosque, where he supervised several field trips and events over the years. The mosque, police, and an attorney representing one alleged victim in a civil lawsuit all continue to ask anyone with information about Gonim to call authorities. We found out before Gonim volunteered here, he worked for a New Jersey nonprofit that helps the developmentally disabled. We reached out to that organization and we're told law enforcement has not contacted them at this time. The mosque has not responded to requests for comment, but in a statement to its congregation, leaders said complete background checks are conducted on anyone who works with young members. Police are not releasing their incident report, telling us the case remains under investigation. But a lawsuit filed by an alleged victim identified as John Doe No. 1 claims Gonim sexually molested multiple boys who looked up to him as, quote, an exalted and divine figure. The plaintiff's attorney tells us the victims thought they were safe at the mosque after many had fled troubled countries like Afghanistan. They're new to America, new to a new society, and, and the, but they trusted the fundamental they know from the, their motherland, which is the mosque, and that failed them. In its statement, the mosque said Gonim was barred from the mosque about four months ago after he was removed from his position as youth director. Istaba also says the investigation has not involved activities on the mosque grounds.